What's good, YouTube? It's your girl, Sienna, and your girl, Zovia. So, today we are going to be recording a entire night with our newborn. And Zovia is only two months right now, so she's still technically a newborn. Newborns are up until two months, and then after that, it's infant. So, she's still a newborn right now, so I'm going to do this while she's still a newborn. So, yep. Y'all will spend an entire night with us and see everything that we do on a, well, we don't really have a routine yet, but what we're doing tonight with Zovia all throughout the entire night, the time we get up and everything. So we're starting this off at, hold on y'all, let me show you, 10.04 p.m. right now. And she don't took her bath, y'all, and everything like that. So she's good to go. She's ready to eat so she can go to sleep. So right now I'm about to start by breastfeeding her. I have a boppy pillow right here. This is what we use every feeding really. So um, yeah, I'm gonna start off by, like I said, breastfeeding her. It normally take about a good um, 30 to 40 minutes depending on her. Hey mama. Yeah, I'm feeding Zovia now, y'all. She is definitely latched on now. So, while I am nursing her, y'all, I just want to give y'all some tips on, like, breastfeeding if you're out there if you're thinking about doing it or maybe if you just start it or whatever once you get that good latch like the first time around after that you should be good to go some parents um do have problems if they start off by breastfeeding and then they introduce the pacifier or the bottle to their baby then that could start off by um your baby not wanting to take your breast anymore they will want the bottle instead of the breast or the pacifier more often so that could potentially mess you up so you shouldn't do that if you want to just breastfeed you want to do both some moms do both and nothing is wrong with that um because we typically I breastfeed Zovia and bottle feed her but it's breast milk it's not formula so she don't drink formula at all she only drinks breast milk like since i'm breastfeeding her now basically the next feeding in the middle of the night one will feed her and it will be from a bottle that is a great option that way like you know the father can you know help out with feeding the baby you're not the only one doing it but nothing is wrong with just breastfeeding like only breastfeeding nothing is wrong with that as well most newborns or babies this age they will nurse for like 30 40 minutes could go up to an hour so that's just some newborn as they get older it will slow down like maybe they will start eating for 20 minutes whereas now Zovia she eat for sometimes 40 to 45 minutes so whenever they as they're growing up it will be less also there is different um, breastfeeding positions for your baby that you can do right now this position that I'm doing is like it's called the football position feet is going back that way like towards my back too i have the cradle position cross cradle hold it's different um ways you can breastfeed so you should really try what's comfortable for your baby at first i was doing the cradle position and i noticed that zovia did not like the cradle position at all so i had to find a great position for her so now i only do the football hold that's all that she do if I do another position, she's getting better with the cradle position, but not as good as she is with the football position. This is like her favorite position to um, nurse in. So, yeah. And also, it's a position where I can't remember the exact name for it, but you like lay down with your baby and you nurse them. So, it's like you're laying on your side and your baby is laying facing your chest on their side and you nurse them just like that. I do that in the mornings, like like when, when she wake up in the morning, six, seven in the morning, and it's time for me to breastfeed, I will nurse her like that. That way, 
you know, you can be comfortable and you can still relax while breastfeeding. So I do that for her as well because it, like I said, it do get tiring having to get up back to back to back to breastfeed or pump. It's definitely not painful at all to breastfeed your baby as long as he or she is latched on correctly. And your baby should be latched on to your areola, not the nipple. So if your baby's just sucking on just the nipple part, it is going to hurt. But if your baby is latched on to the areola like he or she should, then it is not going to hurt at all. And um, like I said, I pump and I breastfeed. So basically every after every feeding, whatever is left, I will pump that out and I will store it in the freezer or I will just put it in her bottle for the next feeding. And right now we have over 200 um, packs of breast milk in our freezer right now. We was thinking on getting a, um, a mini freezer. Also when breastfeeding, um, you should let your baby eat as long as he or she would like. You shouldn't like, you know, take them, he or she off the boob or anything like that. Just let them go for how long they want. Cause like I said, they will like eventually get off or stop whenever they're done. So you should really just wait on that. Cause you want them good and full, you know what I'm saying? If not, you're gonna be feeding them like the next hour. But Zobia, we had a great feeding last night. Um, I breastfed her for like 40 minutes and she slept for three hours, y'all. So that is great. So like I said, at least 40 minutes for a newborn. But as y'all can see, I have, I have switched Zobia to the other breast now. And that that is because um, she was basically pulling away from the other one, so I switched her up. You should always um, like let them drink from both boobs during each feeding, not just one. So if they drink from one for 20 minutes, try the other one and see how much they'll drink from that one as well. So that's what I do each feeding as well. She'll drink from one and the other one. So both, really. So that's what she's doing now. She's drinking from the second breast right now. And... She's drinking pretty good from this one. So yeah, with Keystone, I breastfed him for five months. But with Zovia, my goal is to reach a year with her. I did put Keystone on formula. It messed him up. He was so constipated for a long, long time. So that's one thing I can say. Um, when he was on the breast milk, he was never constipated. Olivia has been nursing for 15 minutes. And it seems like she is almost done with what she wants. That's when they will start moving a lot or fidgeting a lot or basically getting off. That's when you know that they're about done and that is what she's doing. I just changed her diaper and everything so I do not have to do that again. I should have showed y'all that part but I didn't so yeah. I will show y'all everything that we do in the middle of the night. Her setup is right behind me. You can see it over there at the back. Her bassinet and underneath her bassinet is her, where we keep our diapers and her wipes for the middle of the night. And my pump and everything is over there as well. So y'all, I just finished nursing Zobia. She just burped. She burped fast, but yeah. She just burped fast that time, so. As you can see, she spit up a little bit. Normally after that, like I said, I change her and everything, and then I go in and lay her down in her bassinet so she can go to sleep, cause she is sleeping. She was just asleep in my arms right before I started the video. She is over there, y'all, right now. Well, I live now. You see what she's doing? Y'all see, y'all see. She won't fall asleep. But she'll fall asleep in a few. If not, I'll have to rock her. Yeah, so she'll definitely fall asleep in a few. And like one said, if she don't, he will rock her to sleep. Oh my but this is my pump bed, y'all. Like I said, after she get done eating as much as she oh. want, I will finish emptying the rest out with oh. my pump. That's what I'm about to do now. So, I don't know if I showed y'all before, but this is the pump that I use. It's the Medela Freestyle, Medela Freestyle pump. Y'all can see it, it's a Medela right up here, yeah. And this is like a freestyle pump, handheld. 
it's just very it's great like you could just pump it everywhere and as y'all can see that's what Zovia is doing right now so spend the night with us y'all gonna see what goes down in our household with a newborn and this is what time it is now it is 10 27 i think when i showed y'all at first it was like 10 04 something like that but yeah it's 10 28 p.m
have like five something in the morning we just got up to feed so she just woke up she slept for a little while but now she's feeding i just got up like 25 minutes before they did to pump i pumped out i think like seven and a half to eight ounces i should probably drink about five and a half to six ounces So good morning y'all, it is early in the morning and um, I am feeding Zovia again. She's gonna be eating for probably about 30 minutes or more. So basically y'all, this is about to be the end of this video because y'all spent an entire night with us. And as y'all can hear, Kisa is up as well. So we're about to go get him up and feed him. And yeah, I'm just gonna continue to feed Zovia for, like I said, the next 30 40 minutes so that is the end of this like comment and subscribe and y'all see how many times we get up throughout the night with zovia um she's getting better but 
still we get up about three four times you see that right <laughs> so yeah just like comment subscribe stay tuned for more videos comment down below what else y'all want to see and we shall put it out for y'all